should share all good things with their instructor. Do not be deceived. God cannot be mocked. A man reaps what he sows. So if you're sowing to the flesh and you're doing things that sow things to the flesh and you're going to reap a, a harvest of flesh, you can't expect God to come down and, and help you and save you if you're reaping flesh. If everything you do is flesh, if you're not giving him no time, if you're not praising him, if you're not seeking him, and even when the one day you do go to church on Sunday, you don't raise your hands up, you just sit there and listen. Oh yeah, preach pastor, preach. But when worship comes by, you're just standing there and you give a little tiny bit of clapping, a little tiny bit of singing a song. You don't even listen to the words that the song is saying. And you don't take it to heart. When you sing to God, you need to sing in the spirit and in the truth. You need to worship him in spirit and in truth. With everything you do, do it with your spirit. Don't do it with your soul. Don't let one word come in your ear and go out the other ear. Because whatever you sow to please your flesh, from flesh you will reap destruction. Whoever sows to please the spirit, from the spirit you will reap eternal life. So if you're doing everything in the spirit, the spirit's going to grant you that eternal life you're looking for. Let us not become weary and good. For at the proper time, we will reap a harvest if we don't give up, if we don't faint, if we don't fail. We will we will reap a good harvest. Therefore, we have an opportunity. Let us do good to all.